guys, uh, welcome to another Salty Strikes Fishing Adventure. I'm Chris and today is the first day of the Atlantic uh, Red Snapper season here on the east side of Florida and uh, we're fishing out of Ponce Inlet today. I just filled up the boat with gas and um, I'm meeting a friend and I already got a friend that's already at the boat ramp and he says it's pretty packed. Um, it's going to be a busy day at the ramp and a busy day on the water. So hopefully we'll get into those uh, Red Snapper that we're never allowed to keep. Um, and uh, make a David. All right, guys, um, we're uh, on the water. I we skipped that long line and uh, went to an alternative boat ramp. Luckily, it wasn't very busy. Um, so we're on the water now, and um, we're gonna meet up with a friend to share some bait that we got because bait was kind of scarce. And um, then we're gonna head out there. Last year, I got on the water probably about 30, 45 minutes with, uh, uh, before the sun even came up and we were already fishing. And I don't know if you guys remember this, but I got a 35 inch red snapper on my very first drop. Um, and uh, so I don't know if lightning is gonna strike twice this year, but we're gonna get out there and make a go of it. I doubt I'll make another 35 inch monster like I did last year. Uh, who knows, uh, we'll see what's out there. But man, there's a lot of boats out here. Um, I hope everybody's being safe and um, so we'll get out there. All right guys, uh, we're making our first stop and we're only probably about six miles out about 70 feet deep and uh, we're gonna see what we can do here before we try to make it out further. It's a little windy right now but I think it's supposed to calm down a good bit uh, this afternoon so we'll make go of it. Troy, today we're we got cut bait, we got shrimp and uh, we're chumming up the water a little bit and then throwing lines down. Alright this is the first drop. Hooked up! Let's see what we got. I think it's little. It is. <laughs> Look at the size of that red snapper. <laughs> it is a red snapper, but way too small. Yeah, here's here's my limit. He's going back. You know, we kind of, uh, you gotta kind of ask yourself before you get out here, what are you, what's acceptable? Because like, if you keep throwing, you're only allowed one per person. So if you keep throwing them back, like what's your limit? Where are you gonna stop at? And I said, if I get a 20 inch or above, I'm keeping it as my one for the day. Um, I don't know what Joe's limit is, but we'll find out, I guess. Big. Oh, by the way, this is my friend. So I know him. I don't mind, we're so close. That's all right. Eric's hooked up. Oh, I just got hit too. I think he's small. Ah, uh, man, he's hitting hard, but he's letting go. There we go. Got him. This one's a little bit bigger. A little bigger. I may need the net for this one. There you go. Oh. Got a red. What do you got over there? This guy's a little too small for me. I said 20, we're gonna measure him. He's 14, so we're looking for about six more inches. Go down, buddy. What you got there, another shark? All right, so that's number two red snapper. We just need to keep getting them 
that they, they keep gradually getting bigger than like that we'll be doing good here shortly there you go but yeah oh yeah there we go there we go probably a shark we'll see I don't know I don't know, he stopped fighting, he was fighting and he stopped fighting. Alright, get some color, got some color here. Did you hit the button? Nope, I think this is my go home fish. That's mine. I'll take it. Here, get the net, yeah. I'll take it. I don't think he's 20, but that was kind of my number, but if he's close to it. There we go. Plus he swallowed that, damn near swallowed that hook, so. All right. I said 20 and he's 21, so I'll keep him. He's not a monster, but 21 inch red snapper. Didn't take too long. So number three, just kept getting bigger. Part of me wants to throw him back and see if I can get a bigger one, but you know what? I'm happy with uh, this dinner plate size red snapper. Here, can you open the box up? Oh, oh little rocky. And, um, you know, all these grunts I've been catching, I just took one of them and chopped them up to a little chunk about that big. That's what I got him on as a two watt circle hook, I think 2x strong. And I think about a 50 pound leader because they do have a little bit of teeth and shark peel plates and, you know, their mouth's a little rough. So that's what I got them on. Man, our trolling motor just died on us. I don't know what's wrong with it. The motor won't turn. Um, that's weird. What a heck of a time to, for it to go. At least it didn't go out on us when we were in... Well, we didn't really use it that much in the Keys, but... Um, yeah, that's kind of awkward. That sucks. I'm gonna have to old school it, drop anchor. Well, guys, time to make another move. Uh, you know, the bite's kind of slowed down over here, so... We're still not going out too far, because it's... It's a, it's a little windier than we were hoping for. So if it gets picking up for us, it makes for a real rough ride back. But uh, we're gonna keep making a day of it. I still got three people that uh, we're trying to put a red snapper on. Well, we made another move. I think we're about, uh, I don't know, 16, 17 miles out because it didn't seem too bad. And uh, um, front Eric, already hooked up but it lost it so we're put dropping lines down and see if we can you hooked up oh uh got chum out and uh we're gonna see if we can't wrap up this uh atlantic red snapper trip what do we got what do we got what do we got what do we got oh a little nah blue runner bait Hey, shark bait. Off the boat for Joe. Yeah. Oh, oh, hooked up to a good one. Oh man. You want this one? In case, uh, maybe it's not that big. But I don't think he's a sailor's choice, that's for sure. Yeah, cut bait. Oh man. It's a decent one. Not huge, but hey, at least it's not the biggest one. Got a 16. Wait a little. Do you want to fish some more? Yeah. All right. <laughs> I mean.
Uh, we're gonna push this guy back. Uh, we'll let him go. Since, uh... Oh, look at little Ramor trying to get my... <laughs> Did you see that? Little Ramor is getting the... going up my bait right here. Here you go. Here you go, buddy. <laughs> uh, copy that. Fish on. You got? All right. Oh, yeah. Decent? Yeah. All right. Net? Come on. Oh, there we go. That's a nice red. Oh, here, let me get, let me get to that. Um, he's all right. Oh, look. You wanna take him, put him in? There you go. Yeah, he, must, he probably swallowed that. He's 17 inches. Do you want him? Yeah, might as well, I guess. All right. So Joe's going to take the 17 inch home. We may fish a little bit longer, but um, uh, well, my other friend, his son's uh, not feeling too good. The waves have been getting to him. So we're going to let him have our, our second fish and uh, he's probably going to take it in and we're going to keep going out here and Joe's going to try to get his keeper. Hopefully. Yep. Right. Have a good one. There we go. Oh, there we go. Yep. Oh yeah, this is a good one. Oh crap. Oh man. Yep. Yep. Oh yeah, he's got some color there. This one looks like a nice one. Oh man. All right, you're gonna have to get the net for that one before I lose him. Got him in the corner of the mouth. All right. <laughs> this is what we came here for. You can catch it though. Oh. You know, that's mine, right? <laughs> All right, here we go. Nice red. Let's see how big he is. Let me get this hook out real quick. Ow. Man, they got pointy stuff. 25 inches. It's not bad. That's snap for season. You wanna throw that guy in the box? Oh, sweet. All right, so that's our two. And man, Watch that was a good one. Oh, yep. All right, guys, that's going to wrap up day one of this Atlantic Red Snapper uh, season. Uh, we only get three days this year. And today, I was just using a simple fish finder rig, the four ounce uh, egg sinker. And um, I got a 50 pound leader to about a number two or three out circle hook, inline circle hook. And uh, we caught all our red snapper today on Sailor's Choice. They're a little grunt, and um, we just cut them up into chunks of about that big and sent them down. So but that's going to end day one. Uh, there will be more to come. So if you haven't subscribed yet, the button's down there and uh, notification bell, all that jazz. And um, we really appreciate all those thumbs up and positive comments. And hopefully we'll come back out tomorrow and limit out again. You know, we only get three days to keep these things. And, you know, it's not the end of the world if you don't get out here. Because, you know, you only get three days. So, you know, it is what it is. But anyway, thanks for joining us. And we'll see you next time on the water, guys. Stay salty. Bye.
Hey guys, I forgot to remind you, don't forget to visit saltystrikesfishing.com and uh, you know we have hats for sale. That is on. Uh, so there's still there's still plenty left and uh, we're running short on a couple of colors, but we'll probably be ordering more soon. So uh, don't forget to check it out.